Hi, this video is the uh, art of hair transplant restoration for women, and she, you know she's an Asian girl, and you know when doing her research, she had a hard time finding some of my video, in for uh, women who are uh, Asian descent. She she saw I have a lot of example for African American, uh, Caucasian, and other ethnic, but for Asian, not many. Uh, the culture wise is, is uh, you know more reserved, so. It's, um, more difficult, but I perform all different races uh, from all different ethnic background. Um, as you know, I'm one of very few surgeons who specialize in woman hair restoration, and uh, and then she's now because of that she want to uh, you know allow me to film her and then to help other Asian girl um, that you know you don't have to live with a big forehead, uh, receding hairline. Those stuff there are. Uh, technique for hair transplant to fix it, but you have to go to the right surgeon and a reputable surgeon because uh, if people don't know what they're doing, they can potentially ruin your life. Because with hair transplant, especially women hairline, it's a lot more complicated than men, and uh, there's art behind surgery. And as I made all my video, I mentioned you need both an artist and a surgeon to give you the most natural look and the most density. And her density is fantastic. The great thing is now she can pull her hair, wear her hair in the ponytail, and no one knows she has had surgery. And that's what you want to do. And uh, this is one of the greatest satisfaction of my work, um, to be able to make a change for a person, individual's life for the better. So we, we, she had a wide forehead, we see her in the corner, and we lower that. And you see now forehead smaller, and the temple brought in quite significantly. And this is a close-up view. So we dip down the front and we have a wave and zigzag and trying to bring in the hairline down now the forehead smaller, but it's natural. Now the right hand side, you see how significant her hairline receded and her forehead looks wide. What we did is we brought in at least an inch or more or two and a half inch from here. And again, we don't go straight circle. We brought in an inch, an inch and a half, and we have wave and zigzag to it and the hairline come in. Very, very good density. Uh, left hand side again, we brought in, see that's where she was, so we brought in at least an inch and what a nice wave to, to zigzag. And look at that, and the flow and good density. Top view, you can see how significant the hairline is. The receding is uneven, by the way. The left hand side is more than the right. Uh, but now it's even. Now she can wear her head in the ponytail and without worrying that, you know, does it look natural or not. And this is where she is now. And, very good density, and <clears throat> I'm gonna comb through so the audience to see um, that you know, it works. And the most important thing is there's art behind surgery, and you see how I uh, wave and and we brought in the temple in, and a little wave zigzag as well. Good density. And it's so real here. You can cut it, you can perm it, you can definitely dye it. Uh, but the most important thing is. It's natural, and, and no one knows she has had surgery. And because she has long hair, she, you definitely can hide it. And women, I'll tell you honestly, all, all my clients, 99.9, .9 do the strip method FUT. It's not because the price of FUT is cheaper that why women choose the FUT. Because women wear the hair long, and no one's going to see the scar anyway. So why not do something where it's a strip method, you can get everything done one day. Sometimes FUE might take two years. The strip method can give you the best density, more better than FUE. And the linear scar for women, they never never gonna be visible because women really don't wear the hair shape. So can you turn your head for me, face to me, straight? Look at that. Excellent density. And you turn to the other side for me too. And you see the forehead smaller. And I wanna come through uh, even on this side. Let me see. You pull it through, and it's good density. Sorry, she has a lot here, and you know we comb it down out here. Yeah, we have good coverage. And, and the key word is that if we brought in the whole one inch here, and then the hairline brought in, and it flow. Okay, good. Coverage, good density, very natural. And this is the art of hair transplant restoration surgery result. 
one pe one year post out. We'll be going out the photo by Dr. Lee. And this client's kind enough for me to allow me to film her so I can help other aging girls as well. Thank you.